heart attack. A heart attack, also known as myocardial infarction, MI, occurs when the blood supply to a part of the heart muscle is blocked, usually by a blood clot. This lack of blood flow can cause damage or death to the affected part of the heart muscle. The most common symptoms of a heart attack include chest pain or discomfort that may feel like pressure, squeezing, or fullness, pain or discomfort in one or both arms, the back, neck, jaw, or stomach, shortness of breath, nausea, vomiting, or lightheadedness, sweating. It's important to note that not everyone who has a heart attack experiences all of these symptoms and some people may not experience any symptoms at all. If you or someone you know is experiencing symptoms of a heart attack, it's important to seek medical attention immediately. Call emergency services right away and follow their instructions. Early treatment can help reduce damage to the heart and improve the chances of survival. Causes of heart attack There are several causes of heart attack, including 1. Coronary artery disease, CAD. CAD occurs when plaque builds up in the arteries that supply blood to the heart. Over time, this plaque can cause the arteries to narrow and harden, reducing blood flow to the heart muscle. 2. High blood pressure. High blood pressure, or hypertension, can cause damage to the walls of the arteries and increase the risk of CAD and heart attack. 3. Smoking. Smoking damages the blood vessels and increases the risk of CAD, which can lead to a heart attack. 4. Diabetes. Diabetes increases the risk of heart disease and heart attack, particularly if it is not well managed. 5. High cholesterol. High levels of cholesterol in the blood can contribute to the buildup of plaque in the arteries, increasing the risk of CAD and heart attack. 6. Obesity. Being overweight or obese can increase the risk of CAD and heart attack. 7. Family history. Having a family history of heart disease or heart attack can increase your own risk. 8. Age and gender. Men are at higher risk of heart attack than women, and the risk increases with age. It's important to note that some people may experience a heart attack even if they don't have any of these risk factors. Additionally, some risk factors, such as age and family history, cannot be controlled. Prevention from heart attack There are several steps you can take to help prevent a heart attack. 1. Quit smoking if you smoke, quitting is one of the best things you can do to reduce your risk of heart attack. 2. Manage your blood pressure. High blood pressure is a major risk factor for heart attack, so it's important to get your blood pressure checked regularly and to take steps to keep it under control. 3. Manage your cholesterol levels. High levels of LDL, bad. Cholesterol in the blood can contribute to the buildup of plaque in the arteries, so it's important to get your cholesterol levels checked regularly and to take steps to keep them under control. 4. Manage diabetes. If you have diabetes, it's important to keep your blood sugar levels under control to reduce your risk of heart attack. 5. Maintain a healthy weight. Being overweight or obese can increase your risk of heart attack, so it's important to maintain a healthy weight through a balanced diet and regular exercise. 6. Exercise regularly. Regular physical activity can help reduce your risk of heart attack, so aim for at least 150 minutes of moderate intensity exercise per week. 7. Eat a healthy diet. Eating a diet that is rich in fruits, vegetables, whole grains, lean protein, and healthy fats can help reduce your risk of heart attack. 8. Manage stress. Chronic stress can contribute to heart disease, so it's important to find ways to manage stress in your life, such as through exercise, relaxation techniques, or therapy. 
It's also important to get regular checkups with your doctor to monitor your overall health and to discuss any concerns you may have about your heart health. Bye-bye, take care.